we proclaim your name. Standing here, standing here, in the midst of us, we raise you up with our praise. Minutes oh, left. Yeah. If, ever, if ever you can sit here first, then you can do it. Amen. 20 minutes. I know. 20%, not 20 minutes. Okay, 20 minutes. Yeah, I brought my charger because I know it will happen. Thank you. Okay. <coughs> Let me see what is happening on the screen. Yes, okay. Hallelujah. Let's take our Bible in the book of Ezekiel. Ezekiel chapter 37. Verse 11 to 14. Amen. Ezekiel chapter 37, verse 11 to 14. Let's read in Tagalog. First, the God is not my Bible, I'll try to adapt myself. Now, man, Kagai, Kagayo, Sinabi. Mama Beth, can you read for me? Because I am uh, I, I, my time is short. Yeah, please read. Ezekiel chapter 37, verse 11 to 14. Can you turn on her, please? Come here. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Ezekiel. 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 
In that dry situation, you want to abandon God. In that dry situation, you want to turn back to God. You, you refuse in the word of God. Your faith are becoming on off. In that dry situation, you don't believe anymore someone that comes to talk about Jesus. In that dry situation, you feel that things are not really how it's supposed to be. In that dry situation, you think that now you can do things about when you want capacity. In that dry situation, your, your faith, there is no more faith in you. It's now doubt that are taking place. Because when you look around, no more money, no more food, no more love, no one look at you, no more priority. Your life is mixed. The Bible says they were like those dry bones that was the children of Israel, and they were sad to lose you home. But he says, Son of man, prophesy. And as a man of God, I have come tonight not just to prophesy, but to speak what God has in his mind for you. Yeah. He said that I will put my spirit in you. Hallelujah. Why? Because you are going for that situation because there is no Holy Ghost. It's now doubt ghost. It's now murmuring ghost. It's now angry, angry ghost. But the Lord said, I will put my spirit in you. And he said, I will take you from the grave. Maybe right now you feel that you are in the grave. Hallelujah. Can you get it? Because when someone's in the grave, there is no more life. Amen. When someone's in the grave, he just say he cannot talk. Everybody around him moving, but he cannot do anything. Maybe your situation look like this. But he said, I will take you out of your grave. I will put my spirit in you and I will put life to you. Maybe you also thinking like the sister of Lazarus. The Bible says that the sister of Lazarus, when Lazarus died, day one, day two, day three, day four, Balam Bagasa. When Jesus came, he said, Where do you put this, my friend? They said, No, my hope. Don't try again. Maybe your situation tonight is in the same situation. Now. Maybe your situation today of this church is in the same like the people of Israel. Hallelujah. Maybe your situation right now, if you look at the children of Israel, when you look at the church, we say there is no more hope. Wallah, Bagasa. But the Lord said, I will put my spirit in you. I'm a somebody. God said, He will put His spirit in you. That's your, from your dead grave. From that dead situation, from that dead marriage, from that dead business, from that dead situation, from that dead family life, from that dead financial life, from that dead situation that you are going through, that you lost hope, that you will come out of it and you will have life. The sins of Lazarus say what? Lord, it's many already. Maybe you also, where you are, you are telling my situation is only smiling and no more. You are thinking that nothing can change it. But the Lord sent me to tell you tonight that He will bring you out of that game. And He will give you life. And you will know that He, the Lord, has spoken. Amen. Can we stand up? For the few minutes, we are going to pray. Say with me. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I declare. I declare. That I stand. I stand. In the blood of Jesus. In the blood of Jesus. Therefore. Therefore. Any situation. Any situation, Lord. Dry situation. Dry situation, God. In my life. In my life, Lord. In my marriage. In my marriage, Lord. In my business. In my business, Lord. In my financial life. In this church. In this church, Lord. That are making me to lose hope. 
from today, today as I stand, stand and I pray, I, pray. I declare, I be broken in the name of Jesus. Be broken in the name of Jesus. Come, somebody pray. Every dry situation in your life, command it to break. Command it to break. Command it to break. Come, 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 whatever you are losing hope for. If it was about your situation, situation, if it was about your wife, if it was about your financial situation, command in the name of Jesus, let that be break. Now, as you prophesy, speak on your own life. Let that difficult situation, let that hard situation, let that terrible situation, let that hopeless situation be breaking. In the name of Jesus, come with somebody. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Let that situation be breaking. Let that evil situation be breaking. Let that Simon the social situation be breaking. Let that evil one that be spoken be breaking. Let that satanic agenda be breaking. In the name of Jesus, come on somebody. In the name of Jesus, let that situation contrary to God's word be breaking. In the name of Jesus, let that prosperity flow back up. Be breaking in the name of Jesus. Come on, somebody. Lebo, Shalabo Kara, Lekaraba Siva, Ikabo Semeraba. In Jesus' name. So we pray in the name of Jesus. Jesus. I stand in the blood of Jesus. Come on, come on. I stand in the blood of Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. And I declare every hopeless situation. Every hopeless situation out of my house, from my father's side, from my mother's side, from my house, from my in laws' house, from my parents' house, that are making me to lose hope. From today, as I step out in this church, let that situation be breaking, be breaking, be breaking. Be breaking. Be breaking. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. If you are here, oh, come on, somebody. I want to do something here. Rabba, 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 in Jesus' name. I want you to put your hand on your hand. I have five last minutes. Hallelujah. In Jesus name. Let every come on. Say with me in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I stand in the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Let any kind of sin that doesn't from God, that the enemy has put in, in my belly, in my womb, in my liver, in my heart, in my kidneys, as I pray. In the name of Jesus, I command, be breaking, be breaking, be breaking, be breaking, be breaking, in Jesus' name. You are here and you are hopeless. Today is the day of your restoration. God is giving you his spirit. God is giving you his spirit. God is going to show his evidence from now. Oh, you are going to receive a call in the name of Jesus. Okay. And somebody is going to tell you hallelujah. that now the Lord has visited you. As I come in this church, I declare oh, whoever is here that is expecting an income, someone will call you and tell you yes. yes, come on. About 3,000 issues. Hallelujah. Someone will call you and give that to you in the name of Jesus. Okay. Issue. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Whatever you say that you are expecting. People look at you down for a long time and you feel discouraged and you wanted to empire. You say, Come on, I have been serving God for many years, but right now I wanted to back out and go to the world. I declare from today, the Lord is removing that bitterness in you. The Lord is removing that discouragement in you. The Lord is removing that back out spirit in you. The God is putting his spirit and take you from that grave and give you life in the name of Jesus. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. In Jesus' name. I want to pray for water before I do. Name. Mama, I need just give me water. Glass of water or bottle of water. Make fast, please. In Jesus' name. Just, I'm going to ask you a glass of water. 
for yourself. Eh? No, that's a book. Mama, no, get no, you don't mean that I want that? Oh, no, for yourself. One book, one water for you. Just get it. God is going to do something. Because I know. Brother. Oh no, I not Brother Julie. This is your trial. But at the end, you will be victorious in the name of Jesus. Amen. This is your trial. But at the end, you will be victorious. You will be victorious. She will leave you and she shall not die. Amen. And the child is born properly in the name of Jesus. Amen. I command the blood of Jesus to walk in the house of the Spirit. We have given you. Yeah, don't remove the headset. Otherwise, I can you, you cannot record my voice. Come on. Just put the head. Yeah. Yes, that will be your trial. Come on, come on. I'm going to finish because I cannot read the text again. And you click me some trouble here. That's a let's pray faster. Let's pray for that one. In Jesus' name. 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 In Jesus name. So, no. Why? Man, it's about money? No, but water. Ah, so you need to invest to buy more No, you have glass, but you cannot open it. Ah, okay. In the name of Jesus. Okay, okay. No, it's okay. No, it's okay. In the name of Jesus. Yeah, please don't open it. We are almost done. Because the guy is waiting for me. Okay, to you want to pay one, Pastor? Because we are when the man comes from the, from the exit like this, and the boys can enter. We bless you, brothers and sisters that are online. You are welcome. Look, you can have it. You can have it. It's for you. We, you can have it. Eh? Don't worry, you can have it. Just, just put somewhere there. Amen. Let us It can be something if you don't believe. It's fine. But just do what I say, and you'll see the next. Now, uh, now, every time I do a record, that people can see. Amen? I believe that God is about to do something. We welcome you for those who are watching us. We are here in Barangay Sichoduka, in the city of Abalaka, province of Papanga, in the country called Philippines, Asia. And we bless the name of the Lord for you. And we believe that God is doing something great. If you take this video, it's not a lie. By watching, recording, just do what we say and pray as we pray. And you see what God is going to do. Follow those prayers and exactly do it. He's in Jesus' name. There is nothing. The Bible declared that Jesus came somewhere and saw a man who was blind. Born blind. Not Bartimaeus, but another one. And when the Lord Jesus arrived, what he did, he took soil. Soil, Lupa, and he put his saliva. He put his saliva on the soil, and he put in the eyes of the blind man, and the blind man's eyes was open. That's what we call prophetic action. Why? He's guided by the Spirit of God. It's not done in the flesh. If you don't have the flesh, it doesn't work. But if you don't it spiritually, as you believe, it will work. Therefore, believe it. I'm joining my faith to your faith. Thank you, Jesus. Slowly, slowly, because I'm recording. I want you to hold your bottle of water. Brother John, I don't know if you have a bottle or just a glass. But as we pray, this morning, I never knew that your wife, I, I saw you the visit of your wife saying that she had she will she have uh, she want to give her. But this man when was preaching in Sibera, I say that there is young woman having some problem in the stomach. I don't know whether it is wife or not. I believe to hear it in the body said sit down on YouTube or Facebook. And I believe that if we pray tonight, God is going to do something. That's what
So I want to tell you now, we are going to pray. Okay? I don't know what is the hopeless situation you are going through. Me, I don't know. God knows and you know it. I have mine. You have yours. Amen? Each one of us has something that is hopeless somewhere. Someone can be for money. Someone can be for something else. Everybody has something somewhere. We are going to pray. And after the prayer, I will pray for the water, and then I will take off. I mean, I will go. Let's make it faster. Let's pray with me. Say with me, I stand in the blood of Jesus. I stand the blood of Jesus. I stand in the blood of Jesus. I stand the blood of Jesus. No, leave the water for now, not it. I stand the blood of Jesus. I stand the blood of Jesus. And I declare. And I declare. Any hopeless any situation. Any hopeless situation. In my life. In my life. In my household. In my, household, in my children life. Children life. In my husband life. life. In my wife life. life. That I'm making that we cannot be free. Oh, As I pray, As I, pray I command. Be praying. In the name of Jesus. Hopeless situation. I command. Be broken in the name of Jesus. Oh, bless situation in my life that make me think that I am in the grave. I command be broken in Jesus' name. Lord Jesus, tell me, Lord Jesus, help me and deliver me. Lord Jesus, help me and deliver me. Lord Jesus, help me and deliver me from that situation. Deliver me from that problem. Deliver me from that trial. Deliver me from that hopeless. Give me your spirit. Take me out of the grave in the name of Jesus. Lord Jesus, deliver me. Help me. Deliver me. Deliver me. Help me in the name of Jesus. Amen. Take your water. Speak on the word, what you want God to do for you. Speak on the word. Just speak on it. Whatever you want God to do for you. Speak on it. Pastor, help me. What? From where? See the lamp? Oh, yeah. I use. Okay. Just speak on it. Speak on it in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah in Jesus' name. Hallelujah in Jesus' name. Hallelujah in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Speak on it, speak on it, speak on it. Whatever you, you believe that is impossible to men, speak on it. Whatever you want God to do for you in the name of Jesus. Say with me, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, say with me now, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I declare this water to be the blood of Jesus, that when I drink and I wash my face, every hopeless situation becomes hopeful in the name of Jesus. Every hard situation that will trouble in me, in my finance, in my marriage, in my house, in my life, in my spiritual life, that are stuck in me as I pray on this water and drink it and wash my face. Let that sickness be healed in the name of Jesus. Any and no and no sickness as I wash my face. And pray on this water and drink it. Let that sickness be healed in the name of Jesus. Let that problem go the solution in the name of Jesus. Every dry situation that was in my life, that are troubling me, as I pray and I drink this water and I wash my face, let that situation be broken in the name of Jesus. Every dry that was there. Every financial problem that are going on in my life, in my children's life, 
in my household as I pray and wash my face and drink this water. Let the problem receive an answer in the name of Jesus. Something is happening right now, Jesus. This water is the chain with blood, Jesus. This water be changed in the blood of Jesus right now. Lift up your robe, lift up your bottle, lift up your glass. Lord, I command you, let every water now be changed in the blood of Jesus. The Bible said there was an angel coming always to get in the water and shake the water. Whoever could get inside the water was he. Let this water in every glass and bottle. Let in the name of Jesus. Let the angel move now. That anyone that will drink this water, any kind of sickness, diabetes, heart attack, blood pressure, yes. coronavirus, kidney failure, any kind of sickness, as they drink this water and wash their face and place where they were sickness, let them receive total healing in the name of Jesus. You are here. And you have a problem with your private parts. Mm-hmm. Or if you know anyone that has a problem, whether it be man or woman, that are problem with his private back or a private part, mm-hmm. it can be a sickness. Let the person use after we pray on the water, don't drink oil. Go and give small to the person. If it's a man, let him drink it. If it's a woman, let her use it for a toilet. And so we'll see what God will do in the next coming days in the name of Jesus. Mm-hmm. The blood of Jesus, 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 the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name. Lord, I pray now as I drink this water. Let them receive the call that was expected. If it was an application in the name of Jesus, if it was a business partner, if it was a, a loan, if it was a money coming in, let them receive that call, whether it be from abroad, whether it be from the Philippines, let money come in this world. People that have found on you, people that have forsaken you are coming back. Your number was that forgetted number if you are the phone. Your contact, no one was trying to look out at you. But this week, as you drink this water and wash your face, they are coming back in the name of Jesus. They are getting back to you. Your phone will start ringing now and then. This week, you will receive a lot of call in the name of Jesus. For people, from people like that, they, you thought that they forgot you. You thought that they abandoned you. But they will remember you in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Lord, I bless your name for what you have done this week. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 If you are sickness anywhere, you put that, whatever you are sickness, put in Jesus' name. But if your entire body is is painful, put on your head. If it's your entire body, in the name of Jesus. Yes. Who oh, was this one? I saw I have this one. Me for you. For me, because I drink. <laughs> Believe it in Jesus' name. Lord, I bless your name. You Bible, the Bible declare that you are the living water. And whoever drink you will never have thirst. Standing on the word preached in Ezekiel chapter 37, verse 11 to 40. Let us we pray. Let us receive and they believe. I join my faith to their faith. Let them see, O oh Lord, answer prayers in the name of Jesus. Let them see an unbelievable answer prayers in Jesus' mighty name from the head to their feet. Let the line be open. Let the phone start leaking. Let people start contacting. Let people that forget them start coming back in the name of Jesus. Let them see that you are the God that worked miracle in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen and amen. Okay, before I go, Mama Ben, I know that you met this uh, this young man there. His name is Brother John. Okay, he will no no he will be here when he's uh.
twice and uh, with time and then in the fellowship with you and uh, I rec recommend you please to assist him to make him business easy for him. The calling speak very well Tagalog is because of desire. He's a good preacher and sometimes I can drop by like this to pray with you but he will be pastor in here. He's someone that was with us in Sibera for a long time. I believe and I hope that he will not be a the pastor Christian. And uh, anyway, we never saw we know a new human being, but we put in God's hand. So far as I know him, he never offended me. Therefore, I believe that he's a good man. And I believe God will use him. He's baptized in Jesus' name for, for the remission of sin. He baptized us of the Holy Ghost. And I believe, yes, he's a very shy person, but God is using him. Amen. And uh, he's going to, to be here with you. Let's welcome him and assist him in the ministry. May God bless you, Father. Thank you. It's only six. Are you coming? Or are you staying? <laughs>